Oh. A little sweat, a little mud, a little manure. Conveniently, the guys forgot to wear their muck boots. <laughs> Pet lizard. Everything that y'all have done be well appreciated, I know. Yeah, thank y'all. So, yeah, they were calling for um, some rain, but I really didn't expect this. And there's a whole lot more upriver. And Lawrence is a little worried about the river bottom. And there's two storms in the Gulf. And it looks like who knows what's going to happen with that next week. So if the river fills up with this and we get even a little bit more, it might be bad. What are you oh doing? What are you doing? Oh, well, you know what? There's worse things she could do than play in the rain. <laughs> it's a river down there. Don't fall. <laughs> yeah, you haven't done that in a while. <laughs> Now's like the perfect time. Now's the perfect time? Mm. Well, it's not hurting anything. The water, the pool needed a little bit of water in it, yeah, so I that's helping. It. I'm pretty sure it got it. You think it got it? <laughs> You're cold. <laughs> it's lightening up. Maybe it'll, maybe it'll slack up. <sighs> Come on, boy. Last meal. It's your last meal here. Eat up, boys. Got um, another almost two inches in the last 24 hours. Uh, half an inch overnight it came down hard I heard it um, so yeah so the buyer is he was supposed to maybe come this morning but he's he's behind so we hopefully are gonna get these guys out of here this afternoon bust my butt because uh, it's very possible this morning got a little mud on the tires <laughs> just a little bit but they're coming in coming in handy I'm spraying that one hole so three days later my finger's still a little bit swollen it really put a a number on me but um he said I just should have let him shock me again but anywho I'm alive it's all good oh yuck joy joy alrighty okay boys we're gonna get these weighed and the guy is I'm gonna be here in a few hours to get them. And we have a nice muddy mess. Oh, the string came off of here. 
shoot, my string is missing that holds my gate. Okay, well, hopefully y'all don't get behind it. 32. Yeah. Okay, we got the next group in uneventfully, which is always welcome. I'm gonna run them through, weigh them, sort out a few, and uh, we'll be good. So far, so good. Come on, babies. Thank you for the mud on the neck. Try to get a few too many in there. A little sweat, a little mud, a little manure. Good day. <laughs> this thing got warm again. Hey, babies. Going on a little crop check before we load the steers. The fork and hooves are still eating. <laughs> they look pretty good. They're not very dark. But they're full. They're fuller than they were. Hmm. All the deer tracks. These beans have a pod on them already. I see. The other ones don't. These have been ahead from the get-go, though. These are beans that were flooded. <laughs> Other than that patch out there. <laughs> Crop of morning glories. These look good. He's saying morning glories and vine weeds. Took over right here. Oh. That Sudan is coming up too out there again. Good gosh. It'll be ready to cut. It is ready to cut. This is all level. Looks great. Good job, Lawrence. What did you say? A whole lot of what? Diesel fuel and John Deere. <laughs> diesel fuel and diesel time. fuel and John Deere and time. Yeah, that's true. Looks good. Got a little water standing out there on the little swimming pots. There's a little. I see it. A little water standing out there. Yeah, there's some water standing out there. This used to be my favorite field when we were doing hay because it was the last one. You're right. It was the last one. And one time we were down here and it got dark and I didn't know how to turn the lights on my tractor. <laughs> the first time I wrecked with the cab tractor, we were down here and I couldn't find my lights. I need a bath. Oh well. Hey, Bonnie. Bonnie. <laughs> Sudan, Sudan. Ready for? That's huh. it. That's one, two, two. You see every one. Then it gets up. He's saying the tracks where we raked and bailed kills it.
said he put 35 units of nitrogen on this sorghum Sudan after we cut it. 60. 60 units. <laughs> Feels good. Feels good to have them sold. So tomorrow morning we only have to feed the girls. A few boys. Not many though. Yeah. Oh gracious, it's hot. It's very sticky today. So anyway. Um, yeah. That's a day. That's a wrap. Let's we'll see what tomorrow holds. John? Yes. Happy puppies. <laughs> Happy puppies in the world. Here, take this. You got some fresh meats. Oh, yeah. Yay. From our friends, our buyers. Okay. <laughs> There's some happy puppies. They've been in their crates for several hours. Hi. Are you happy, Bonnie? Are you such a happy girl? Everybody get some water. Get some fresh water. Woo. I'm gonna fix that mud right there. Good morning, ladies. Water. I know it. Oh, now he's really in the water. The girl was a ski. I know. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Oh, look. Hey. Hey, little lizard. He will not hurt. It's big. <laughs> Wait, let you touch it? Oh, my gosh. Look at him. It's like a pet. Have a little pet lizard. Oh. Yeah, I've been, I've been a barrel slick and I couldn't get out of it. <laughs> here's my home right there. Here's my home. Look at how camouflage he is. Yeah. I don't know about skeet. And skeet's probably not gonna let you catch it. Skeet, yeah. Skeet are still fast. Uh -huh. 
Hmm. So much for no water getting in the mineral barrel. He's still well, he's in there. I don't know water going to get in the wind. Uh, <laughs> <the wind. laughs> yeah, I was trying to get him. There you go, buddy. Okay, I feel so good. We saved some lizards and such. Okay. Let me get the minerals. It actually isn't so muddy. Okay, we'll put some minerals in here. I'll hold the camera for you. You'll hold the camera? I'm a good, the barrel? I'm a good camera holder. Right. I have to do double duty. I have to hold the camera and the bird. She only does one thing, just put a bag of minerals in there. She only does one thing. Okay, there. Wreck me like a rented mule all the time. Never get no appreciation for it. Give me that back. <laughs> needs replacing. That one has seen better day. <laughs> it does look like a big mouth. Well, you're still wearing them, so I guess that means they're okay. The boots, do you like them? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> the Ariats are hanging in there. A lot of people really want you to like treat them with some leather conditioner or yeah, something. It needs, he said, yeah. You need to do that. This little alert, this little alert, that's a big one. That one's been bloomed out. Look at the um, butterflies or moths on it. Hmm. Ooh. This one's gonna get the machete works. Or whatever you call that. I think it's a machete. Hat. Safer right here. Hmm, that was a big one. It's Sunday, and I've got a praying mantis on me. He's gonna bite you, you think? Yeah, yeah, bite you, you aggravate him enough. <laughs> a, look, I'm trying to avoid this fight. <laughs>
many you got? 19. You got? There's one coming. I know. There's supposed to be seven more coming. <sighs> like 10 more. Oh. oh. Eight, nine, nine. She's getting That's it. 20. 21. Look! Good girl, good girl. That'll do. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't get all of that. They got to work a little bit. Yay. Good girl. Good boy. Good <laughs> one. Did you want some, girl? I did. I kind of did. I'm just going to let you touch her. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody <laughs> wants them. <laughs> what you got? Yeah, we so we can get in there and go play, girl. Mm, <laughs> she must be bossy. Yeah, get the truck. Lie down. Lie down. Good girl. <laughs> you lie down you got water. her. Get some water, girl. Get some water, girl. <laughs> that feels so good. Doesn't it, buddy? We left Bonnie at home. Cause she, sometimes she barks and chases things, but I feel kind of bad about leaving her at home. While we're sitting here in the cool of the shade on the creek bed, I'm going to give you a little update. I told you in the last video that, um, I was doing a fundraiser for Iowa derecho relief. I might be saying that wrong. Forgive me if I am for the storms that came through Iowa and I was donating money from t-shirt sales and also taking direct um, donations through my PayPal, which I am still gonna be doing, so that's linked in my description. But anywho, that ended up over two and a half days. I can't believe it. We raised $6,500, and a lot of y'all helped with that. I know you did, and I just wanna say from the bottom of my heart, thank you. Isn't that awesome, Lawrence? Yeah, those folks need everything they can get right now. Yeah. We're just, um, I'm just very humbled and grateful that so many people gave. And uh, every every penny helps. And so that money is going to be used towards freezer meals, meals for families, and some gas cards. Because uh, I was told there was a big need for that. Um, I'm working with two different people. Uh, a local person that's a three county area in Iowa that's going to benefit from the money and the meals and the gas cards and so I just want to say thank you you're amazing this community is amazing and um, I'm super proud and humbled and honored to be a part of it so yay mm. you do. we lost the spring planting to the Dan River flood we was able to plant over with now we may not have as good a crop as we could have had but we got something those some of those people have lost everything the house the bonds the bins the crops maybe even the vehicle mm -hmm. and so anything y'all can do and everything that y'all have done be well appreciated i know yeah all right i'm not gonna cry but I am. But anyway, thank y'all.